Hi everyone and welcome to Deus Ex Mankind Divided Permadeath Walkthrough. This is mission 11. We have to talk to Allison and uh, this is a mission that took me a while just because with no augmentations this is this transforms a, a simple mission that maybe it would be simple with augmentations into a fucking one of the toughest missions in the game and I developed a strategy to get to the third floor by doing this shit that you're going to see right now that is actually not easy but uh, I'm going to walk walk you through it uh, step by step so you can guys have a chance to actually do this so see I'm handling all, all sorts of fucking shit and remember you have to deactivate the grenades that are on the building before you can even begin throwing something that you're gonna see me throwing in a second deactivate all this uh, did I say grenade? mines deactivate all these mines uh, for the activation of the mines if you don't know uh, just approach them uh, uh, in a crawling position uh, just really slowly and they will never ne they will never trigger so just approach him and, and disarm and now you can throw these barrels and you have to throw these barrels at the second floor there well that will be the first floor right yes that will be the first floor so throw the barrels at the first floor it will trigger a suspicious stance from these guys but it will uh, it will do nothing, uh, it will not raise an alarm see, it will trigger another suspicious right now but you are actually not uh, in invading still here in the, in, the, in the courtyard so now is the fucking tough part now you, you have to grab this uh, crate and this explosive barrel which don't worry it doesn't actually explode uh, when you're handling and you have to kind of put them in a position when you're gonna climb them both and reach the second floor and this is so fucking funny guys because <laughs> to get this to actually work uh, I had to learn the physics of barrels and fucking grates but uh, of course if you, if you don't want to do this just get dash and dash the fucking third floor from the ground or you know from the to the second and then to the third and and then you'll you'll get Allison right away but if you wanna see how I manage without augmentations this is the only way that I could safely get to Allison now if if you know of, a, of another way or, or if you discover another way because the, 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 the building is filled with the cultist guys and see I'm leaving all the mistakes that I'm making because this this will happen to you if you're trying it and uh, I, it's not my intention to waste your time, but I wanted to show you just how tricky this fucking shit is. Now this barrel decided to stay on the on the roof. That's that's good. Um, so here we go again, and this time, oh my god, what was that? <laughs> that that was a, a, a fucking error in, in in input. I must have pressed something that I didn't want to press. So the trick is to get both things, both of those things in the, in the roof, pile them up, first the, uh, the, the uh, exploding barrel, because if not, if you do it the other way around, you're not going to reach the, the, the ledge that you have to climb. And yes, we have to manage with the climbing in those ex-human revolution, which is pretty fucking, like, bad. Yeah, it's pretty fucking bad. So, but the good story is that this, uh, this actually works. <laughs> this actually works and is... Remember the barrels that we threw before to the second floor? Remember those barrels, guys, because we, this is still not over. This is, this is a very fun mission in hindsight. Now, see, I'm going to get this list now. Let's see. Let's see if we can get it. Can we get it? There we go. Now we are on the third floor, actually. So it's important that you get to the third floor and deactivate again more mines in order to get down to the second floor. This this is this is so fucking methodical. See? 
and get these, these barrels and throw them to the third floor because you need only one to land so if you get one to land then that's that's totally fine see I no not that didn't land so let's try it with this one is this one going to land it has to stay there oh my god yes it land that's not as difficult as it, as it seems it usually they will usually land uh, so now we're gonna go all the way back be really careful here guys try try not to knock these things down on your way up again but uh, yeah there we go I'm gonna grab the leash again if I can see I'm, I'm, I'm being I'm, I'm being really careful about the the whole thing because they also can see me through the windows so see that see see that right there that's because she moves through uh, between rooms and she could have saw me there but she didn't so we keep moving the barrel should be here this is good because we have to get the barrel through this hole in the wall what I'm going to do oh uh, yeah uh, I have to take down these guys uh, non lethally so I let them get a uh, suspicious so it's gonna come looking and I'm gonna make a, a takedown from this position because when you do a takedown from this position it's gonna drag the body and hide it where you are and that's very useful to get more people so I get him I close this door because there is someone outside that I don't want him coming in the room I knock this chick out night night <laughs> and now I'm gonna grab the barrel and I'm gonna bring it into this room because I'm gonna use this barrel oh wait I, ha I still have to knock someone else yeah and this is the messiest uh, mission in the in the game because I have to actually knock people out and I'm not really fond of doing that in a ghost run I hope you but bomb maker, Adam, I just uh, what are you gonna do right I mean I, this is the only way that I found that I could get through this level yeah with augmentation. So I'm sure in time people are gonna find new ways uh, to get through this whole level without having to knock out the people to do this because see I have to now use this trash can and get one of the well I guess one of the barrels yeah one of the barrels that landed get them through the hole careful not to knock them down to the fucking first floor again that happened to me and see this is all in one recording guys I'm not I'm not fucking around I mean uh, this is doable this is a solid strategy e every single strategy that you're gonna see in this uh, in this walkthrough I tested it more than once so basically so uh, I can see if I can recreate it right if it was a, a thing of a chance of like one percent or something or or not see what we, we get we got to the third floor so from here it's just Allison is just right there guys she's just right there so see how a mission can that can be potentially really uh, trouble oh by the way I that's a, that's a hack level one I think it's a really complicated hack level one but it's a hack level one and let's see if I can hack it in my first chance because if I cannot I'm gonna cancel the hack and try again I think I'm gonna get it in my first try that's that was really lucky but if you don't just cancel before it gets to an alarm state and just try it again save before the before hacking though I didn't but you should save so now we get inside uh, this is highly edited so I can show you the the answers uh, for her to uh, go peacefully with the police she's the the lady that created the bomb that exploded it at the beginning of the game and yeah I'm just gonna show you all the all the choices and all the answers and uh, that's the mission guys as you can see this this was a really funny mission I, I really liked it I mean I I kind of it, it kind of make me mad sometimes because the fucking barrels just didn't want anything to do with me so I had to actually know uh, 
I had to ad actually learn how to fucking work with physics in this game and barrels and shit, but I, I cannot say it wasn't fun because the strategy is kinda it's kinda funny. Uh so and it's amazing that the game allows me to do this. Again, it is it speaks really really great about the level design that this game has. So this was mission 11 guys, I'll see you in the next one, thank you for watching and take care.